All new at 6, students in Sharon are protesting at school after a teacher was arrested for sexual misconduct. They're not angry over the arrest. Students say they're not surprised by the charges. But they feel the school mishandled this case. And as WBZ's Bill Shields tells us, the administration's response may have only heightened tensions. When Brad Lingus was arraigned last week on charges of indecent assault and battery, perhaps few of his students found it surprising. Lingus has been a teacher here at Sharon High for years. And for years, some female students have felt uneasy in Lingus's class. He was always known to just be very inappropriate to female students. Several female students went to police last fall, and it led to those criminal charges against Lingus. But many students say Principal Jose Libano was culpable too. Personally, I wish that this was handled very, very long time ago um, and, and much faster than it has unraveled. I wish it would. Libano is now on paid leave, and student protesters put up signs at school last week denouncing his lack of action. But those signs were taken down by administrators. I also am concerned that it's just going to be a situation where he's gone and they're going to say, oh, everything is fixed. But the students say even though their signs were taken down, their voices were still heard. I would say that there's a, there's a growing sense of hope, um, a growing sense of empowerment. We tried repeatedly to contact the school superintendent today, but we got nowhere. As for the police, they're now asking that Sharon High School graduates contact them. They've had a problem with Brad Lingus. And Sharon, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.